Hey guys, I'm LB, and let's check out Paper 5 Pseudo Open Door Policy by Paper Player X. This is the time to utilize past skills in new ways. Hashtag the door is open question mark. Hmm. Alright, let's get started, shall we? Interesting. Okay, what does this do? Let's us out. Alright, I'm assuming that this unlabeled button goes to that unlabeled Q dropper to get us the red cube. Let's just, uh, find out. Yep, indeed it does. Oh! Hello! That is... that is quite a drop. You're taunting me with a portal service that's not even big enough to put a portal on. Right, well... There's one thing I know... about... Uh... In fact, this is very reminiscent... of one of my maps. Let's do this. There we go. That should do it. Yep, I have a map that does exactly that. Right. Now... Now what? I need to angle this cube appropriately. Uh... Oh! That scared me! It had- I had to lift it up enough for it to spin. There we go. That should theoretically work. If I can raise it up enough, that is. Yes! Bootstrapped! Excellent. Also... Let's be... Player, Clyde with laser, zero, please. Thank you. And the reason I don't bind that to a key is just so that people who see me walking through lasers don't need to ask how I did that. <laughs> what does this do? Another laser cube. It's also red, so I can't tell them apart. What's the point of making them the same color? I mean, what's the point of coloring them? I know it's like your signature to color them red or whatever, but, I mean... If you're gonna color them at all, make them different colors so that I can tell them apart, even if it's not a cube-swapping puzzle. That's what we need, is we need some puzzles with colored cubes that aren't cube-swapping puzzles, and they're just colored for the sake of being colored. And then, when you play a puzzle with colored cubes, you won't know whether or not you have to swap the cubes. The exit is behind... X. Exit's behind X. Gotta remember that. So that's why it's a question mark, because the exit is open, but in order to get to it, you have to have... you have to deactivate it, so... In essence, it's closed. Because there's a player fizzler in front of the exit. And this is a portal and object fizzler. As I was explaining to Rector Ox recently. Alright, so, let's take this. What does this do? Really? Hmm... But I need the light bridge for it. Suppose that works. How would I ever get back inside? How would I ever get back inside? Quite a conundrum. Oh, I see. It's a, the way to get back is to put the cube here aimed at that and use this laser. Got it. Oh, that was activating something. As well, right? We. So that's square. We need X, right? Oh, we just wanted to take it off of here. Okay. In 
And this goes to this, gotcha. Well, isn't that simple enough? Right now, how do we hit this? Oh, there's a portal surface here. Didn't even see it. So if we head back, the exit... is sort of open. Semi-open. Semi-aquatic, semi-open. What is that? They've got- you've got grating in front of the portal surface I was gonna use. How do I get in there? Do I have to use the light bridge for that? I do, don't I? Devious. Hmm. Well, I have this cube now at the very least, so that's a thing, right? I can portal in there easy- easily enough, I suppose. I know I can recall this cube, but I just decided to grab it this way instead. There's that. Ah, uh, What? There's an observation room in the way, sir. I do believe you've placed an inconvenient observation room in the way. Right, well, whatever. Fine enough. Fair enough, I suppose. Hmm, now what? Am I not aiming properly? Is that too high? Oh, there we go. Hmm... Am I overcomplicating this? I feel like I must be. I need to get this cube into there, though. That's the problem, because I can get over to the exit easily enough. Maybe I only need to get to the exit. Let's save here. Oh, that was strange. <laughs> I wanna simulate that again, so... When, uh, when the light bridge moves, it pushes me up, but when it pushes me up, it pushes me into the portal. Ha <laughs> ha! Oh, that is strange. That is real strange. Alright, well. There we go. <laughs> Alright, so. Let's turn around and now aim at this, and let's see if there's a portal surface in here. I can always quick load if there's not, but there should be. To be an anti-trapping situation, yes! That's what I was looking for. Uh, I don't think we can see that, though. That's the problem. I'm a dia, but die. I'm a red. I'm a... I don't know how the song goes. I know it uses blue instead, though. Oh, come on, I can do this. I just need to get closer to over here, right? No. Mm hmm. Yes, I do believe. I do believe I don't know what to do. Come on. Get in there. I know you want to. Could 
we definitely need to get that. I don't think we need to swap the cubes at all. Pretty sure we don't. Don't think we need to do anything in that room, in fact. I think we can just leave that as it is. clear on the concept. Fat lot of good that does us. Wait a sec. Thought just occurred to me. Give me this cube, please. Thank you. What is the angle on that? that angle on that. That's not quite what I was hoping for, though. Because that angle isn't very useful in any other circumstance. Yeah, we need a much sharper angle to make that work. work anyway. That's too high to work. We can't- we can't go through that because it's graded off. I'm rather perplexed. Because we need the light bridge and... Hmm... I don't know if we need to use this again. That's, like, close, but not really. If we can make this work for both, that'd be great. It's like, there's that, and then... There's that. Let's see if we can make it work here or not. Uh, not looking good. Yeah, that's- that's not gonna- that's never gonna work. Duh. I'm an idiot. <laughs> I massively overcomplicated things, didn't I? I have an extra cube that I can put on an extra button. 
Ta-da! It's like magic. It always scares me, I always feel like I'm gonna fall into the pit. Of despair. There we go. Eh, whatever. So, we can do this, that. Wait, what about this? Didn't really think that through, did I? I don't think that's intended. Like, that's such a tiny sliver, and I fall on the wrong side of the grating when I do that. Hmm. Can I see? can I see from inside here? Not much. Not much at all. Definitely closer, but still not quite there. Perfected this angle to make this not possible. <laughs> One pixel. Yeah, that would allow me to solve this quite easily, but that's not intended, so. Like, these are connected, but I don't think they're connected in any way that's useful, really. Sure, I can do that. But then, then what? Because I can't get into here. Even though I could try and jump the one block gap, I'm pretty sure that wouldn't be intended. Seems rather unintended to me. What to do? What? When did that? How long is? Completely forgot about that. When would I use that though? Because I haven't used that yet. Was I supposed to use that at the start? No, 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 my friend. That is not necessary to start this map. You can delete that in the editor and republish the map. But if I have to use that right now, I don't see that how that's useful, because... I would just point it at the ceiling and then I wouldn't have the light bridge and the laser together, so... Yeah, that's... you can delete that, that's not needed. Go play my map called... Raise the Bar, and you'll understand why. Hmm... 
I don't think I can disable this in any meaningful way. Come on. Oh my gosh, sorry, I'm allergic to getting stuck in puzzles. Yeah, that does that, but... that's not much use, really. I don't see what to do. I am rather stuck. Has anybody else played this? Somebody said it's a great chamber. But no comments other than that. Past skills and new ways. What were the other... other ones... about? There was... taking the back seat... Enlightenment. So taking the back seat was about the faith plates. Enlightenment was about light bridges. White panels was just about laser angling. Do I have to do a laser angle in this puzzle? Maybe. And no log was just introductory to Portal and was basically a, a copy of one of the maps from Portal 1. Ah. Steam does that sometimes. Don't know why. Something to do with hardware rendering, and no, I'm not gonna change any of those settings. I can get in here... with this... But to no avail, really. I could do... Could I do... Hmm... What kind of angles can we do here? I feel like I'm close.
Right, well, I gotta go back out now. The cube didn't want to cooperate. Pretty sure we can get it to cooperate. We do it things in just the right way. That should work. I feel like I'm close. It's just a little bit finicky, maybe. Don't even know if this is intended, but I'm gonna try it. Why else would this be grating instead of glass? Well, I mean, so that you can shoot that, of course. Right, right. So maybe this isn't intended. Excellent. Save. And... Portal bump. Well, not portal bump, but, uh... Portal. Ah, uh, that'll work. Kinda. I just realized there's a flaw in my plan. No! <laughs> oh. Hmm. Right, I didn't think this through. That was weird. <laughs> yeah, not much I can do here, really. This requirement... That requirement... What... do I need to do, then? I know I need to do some sort of portal management, but I can't figure it out. Yeah, these are just connected for show, really. Really see how that's too helpful, except as a shortcut. Like we head in here. There's not much we can do in here. I'm not sure. I think, at this point, I'm just gonna have to stop here, and I'll meet back with you guys once I've figured something out. So, see you momentarily. Okay, so, it's a new day, couldn't figure out what to do, I got a hint from Paper Player X. Remember when you bootstrapped the light bridge with the laser cube? That's not the only cube you can use to bootstrap it. Yes, well, uh... Unless the plan is to get both laser cubes, uh, I mean, unless the cube is to get this laser cube into... into there, like, to swap the laser cubes, then I think what I have to do, actually, is put the regular cube up there, and then have both laser cubes out here. So that's what I'm gonna try, because it, it wouldn't make sense to swap the laser cubes, since that wouldn't really accomplish much. So let's see here... There we go. 
and I think I'll put this guy on the button since we can easily we can easily recall him. There we go. Then we just gotta swap these guys out. Ta-da! And now we should have both laser cubes out here, so... Put that there. And press this. So now we can't get back in there very easily. We have the light bridge, I suppose. There's that much going for us. Although we don't really need it. Except we do really need it. Maybe I shouldn't have respawned the cube just yet. Like, maybe I should put this other cube in position first. Yeah, so that cube's there. Let me put this guy in position, while I still can. Put that portal in the right place, please. Oh, ah, no! Ah. <laughs> uh... <laughs> Didn't- didn't no clip in time. Alright, well, let's try that again, and this time let's not fall to our deaths. I- last- yes, when, uh, when I was doing this earlier, yep, I definitely mentioned how it made me nervous to fall into that pit. Let's do this. Careful. There we go. So we have that in position. Yeah, that turns it off. Problem is... I need the light bridge, though. Like, what would I use the laser cube for, really? Unless I aim it... Can I do that? Actually, now that I think about it. Yeah, maybe we don't need to use this portal surface at all. That's probably the trick. Ah, yes. That's exactly what it is. There we go, that should work. Come on, there we go. And then... Right, then we would recall the cube. Yes, I see now, so... Let's do that, we will save... ...and respawn this cube. Which seals that off. We can point this guy over there. Very clever, that is actually a very clever misdirection. I have- it's been a long time since I've seen a misdirection like that in a puzzle. Excellent, so now we just need to get out of here, and we're done. Back up, and... portal. There we go, that was kinda strange how that made me crouch for some reason. But we're done! Excellent puzzle, I think this is going on my favorites for sure. This is probably one of the more- more challenging puzzles from you I've ever seen. So, anyway, as always, thank you so much for watching, I really appreciate it, and I will see you all in another video. Goodbye! Look at all those monitor screens! Hehehehe <laughs>